Hello, CICS Prairie Eagles. It's your school director, Mrs. Hearth, coming to you live from my house during this COVID-19 shelter-in-place order. I miss you all so much, and I wish that we could be together at school learning and growing together. Um, but in the meantime, while we're in our shelter-in-place, I wanted to read you this story called In My Heart, A Book of Feelings. We are likely feeling a lot of feelings right now with all of the news we're hearing about the coronavirus, with impacts that we might be having in our own families, with our friends, in our communities. So I thought a book of feelings would be appropriate. The author of this book is Joe Wittek, and it's illustrated by Christine Rousey. My heart is full of feelings, big feelings and small feelings, loud feelings and quiet feelings, quick feelings and slow feelings. My heart is like a house with all of these feelings living inside. Where's the heart house? What are some of the feelings you're feeling right now? Sometimes my heart feels like a big yellow star, shiny and bright. I smile from ear to ear and troll around so fast, I feel as if I could take off into the sky. This is when my heart is happy. When is your heart happy? Other times my heart feels strong. I stand up tall as if I can touch the clouds. New people and places don't frighten me. I can do it. Watch me go. This is when my heart is brave. When do you feel brave? When I get angry, my heart feels as if it's going to explode. Don't come near me. My heart is yelling hot and loud. This is when my heart is mad. Sometimes we do feel our heart beat a little bit faster when we are mad, don't we? Lots of feelings. But other times my heart is cool. I bob along gently like a balloon. Here's the cord to the balloon. My heart feels lazy and slow as a quiet snowfall. This is when my heart is calm. Isn't it nice to have those nice, calm, quiet moments just kind of floating like a balloon? On harder days, mean words hurt my feelings and my heart feels hurt too. It's fragile and delicate, but it can be healed with extra kisses. This is when my heart is broken. There's a little nurse fixing the heart. Someday, my heart feels as heavy as an elephant. There's a dark cloud over my head and tears fall like rain. This is when my heart is sad. Sad is a feeling that it is okay to have and it's okay to have tears. It's a normal feeling that we all have. I like how there is a little heart inside of this elephant. But my heart doesn't stay sad. Like springtime after winter, the sun comes out again. My heart grows tall like the plant reaching toward the sky. This is when my heart is hopeful. Here she is watering the plant, reaching towards the sky of hope. Hope is such a great feeling to have. Eek! When I see something scary, my heart beats fast. I feel cold as if a chilly breeze has crawled up my neck and I run away as fast as I can. This is when my heart is afraid. Have you ever felt so afraid that your heart is racing? Looks like she's afraid in this book, <laughs> running away from the monster. When it's time for a bit of fun, my heart feels full of giggles and wiggles. Abracadabra, I hop around like a bouncy bunny. This is when my heart is silly. So she's a, a bunny on a tightrope walking and it looks like she's got a magic hat. Do you like to be silly? Is there someone you like to be silly with? 
I like to be silly with my son. Sometimes I hide my heart away where no one can see, like my own small treasure. I don't want anyone to look at me. Safe on my swing, I can watch the world from up above. This is when my heart is shy. You ever had those moments where you just kind of want to be in your room or be away from everyone and just kind of have those calm, peaceful moments and just observe? That is okay too. It's a normal feeling. My heart can feel so many feelings and yours can too. Today, my heart is proud. How does your heart feel? Today, my heart feels proud of our entire CICS Prairie community. We have done so many incredible things with at-home learning, and I'm so grateful and appreciative to all of you. The last sentence in this book is, how does your heart feel? So I invite you to answer below how your heart is feeling so we know uh, how you're doing out there. Um, we love you. We care about you. And we're here for you for anything that you might need. Um, Thank you for joining me in our my little read aloud in my heart. Hope to see you soon.